Freight and passenger trains will get their own tracks through Maryborough and Ballarat under a $130 million state government project. Passengers will enjoy a more reliable and, and uh, on-time running network. The project also promises the return of passenger rail services to Denoli, closed to commuters since 1981. We're delivering it in a way that ensures that we can pave the way into the future for those services to be added. The bottleneck's been identified by the Transport Minister as a cause for major delays to the Murray Basin Rail Project. On the Maryborough to Ararat line, freight trains are running at reduced speeds until next month and stage three of the works don't have a start date. The minister says timing discussions are still being held with farmers. We don't want to cause too much disruption to their access to their export markets. It was all funded, all planned, all worked out uh, between the state and the federal government under the nationals. And so $220 million at the state level, $220 million at the federal level. It's a transformative project uh, for freight across Western Victoria and uh, they've completely botched it. This announcement comes after the Coalition revealed a $32 million plan to return Denoli's passenger rail in April. Their plan promising the station's refurbishment and to extend the line to Donald. This is the same group of people who represent the same political party who closed country rail lines and cut funding. Casey Lodge, Win News.